What is up guys, Tubbs Gaming here again with another Pokemon unboxing video. Today we're opening the Mewtwo V Battle Deck. Uh, it is slightly different than what we normally do. Normally we'll open booster packs and things like that. We did a video recently and I'll drop a link in the description. The Ice Rider and Shadow Rider Calyrex decks. That seemed to go down quite well on the channel so I popped into Asda. Got this while it was on offer. So let's crack it open and see what's in there. Okay, so there's the packaging for this. There's actually a Meltan one as well, I believe. Um, but I just thought I'd crack open the Mewtwo one because I am old school. Uh, so let's get into this. We're gonna have a look on the back because we have a deck list on the back there. Just move the, the microphone a little bit closer. Um, and in this deck, we have the Mewtwo V card. There's one of those, Hatrine, Hatram, and Hatina. A Starmie and a Star U, a Cinchino and a Mincino, a Lunatone and Indeedy, a Barry, there's a few of those, Bugcatcher, Egg Incubator, Energy Switch, Evolution Incense, uh, four Great Balls, three Lure Modules, Shauna, Switch, and I think that says 10 Psychic Energy. Also in the box, we have three reference cards, one rule book, a playmat, damage counters, all the usual bits and pieces in there. There's a deck box in there, strategy sheet, and one code card, which, as I always do on the channel, I'll drop that in. So whoever's lucky enough to get on to the video and see that code card first can play the this deck in the online version of the game. When we did that Ice Rider and Shadow Rider Calyrex box opening, we spoke a little bit about this play level at the top here. So those decks that we opened previously were play level three. This is play level one, so it's a good place to start if you want a nice ready deck that you can go to your locals and play. What people usually will do with these is they will buy one of these, have a look, and there's usually a sort of a walkthrough on how to update the deck in here. Our last thing we've got on the back there is Mewtwo V strikes big and then powers up your other Pokemon by moving energy to your bench. Um, pull off some speedy attacks with Starmie and uh, what we got, Sanchino. Get more energy into play with Indeedy. I'm struggling to read all of that because I've pulled the security sticker off it. It wasn't nicked, it was paid for. Um, and I have a tree and switch your Pokemon so you can land a huge hit with Lunatone. Useful trainer cards like Lure Module and Egg Incubator. Obviously, this is a Pokemon Go set, so that's why they're in there. Uh, make it easy to find the Pokemon that you can set that can set you on the path to victory. So that's the packaging. Quite nice, actually. I quite like the Mewtwo on the front there and that promo card. I'm looking forward to opening that because that looks stunning. So what have we got? We'll open that. We'll chuck that to one side. Um, Obviously, there's that Mewtwo promo card there. We'll have a look at that in a bit more detail. And the Mewtwo... Oh, that's nice. The Mewtwo uh, counter there. Put that over there. And this is quite useful. And this is why it's a play level one set. Because what we've actually got here is... It's only paper. Um, but it actually shows you how to lay at the table when you're playing. Um, so if you're new to the game, it is quite useful. I'm going to show that on this camera actually. Um, you can see there, obviously that's how the how the table will be laid out. Um, nice picture of Mewtwo in the background there. And what you can do during your turn there. On the back, if you know how to play well, there is a nice little poster there. Let's stick on the wall. I did mention that deck earlier, so you can have a look at that as well that to one side so as you can see already it is a good set for anyone that wants to start out playing there's a rule book as well in there so that you don't get um, shouted at when you're playing which I do quite a lot myself to be fair and it's something that you'll probably always do you're always going to make mistakes and people learn from them so you know what keep making the mistakes it's not necessarily a bad thing um, so what we have there is the outline of the battle deck. Um, is that also talking you through what you can do to change it? Uh, no, I don't think so. And there's the Mel Metal V battle deck on the back as well there. So we'll put that to one side as well. 
Uh, and then you've got some nice little damage counters there. So if you haven't got the dice, or this is the first thing po Pokemon product you've ever bought, and you want to get straight into battling, uh, nice little damage counters there for you. What else have we got? The important thing for you guys, there's that redeem card. So you can get that on the online version of the game. And that stunning new TV card. Really nice card there. Really, really nice card. Mewtwo. Oh, terrified me as a kid. What have we got here? The... Don't know what this is. Let's have a look. Ah, so it's like... It's little crib sheets, really. For when you're playing, you can sort of keep these by you. Um, I suppose it helps you a little bit. tells you what to do if anything happens. So, what are the special conditions? Can a Pokemon have multiple special conditions? Things like that. Lots of little questions. It's like a small... FAQ booklet there. There's three of those and the promo card at the top there. And then you've got the nice little deck box there with Mewtwo on. And all the cards are inside here. So what I would suggest is get yourself out, buy some cheap um what was I gonna say? Buy some cheap uh, sleeves to look after your cards. Obviously energy, we have Barry, Atena Dream, that lure module, uh, Shauna, Staryu, Great Ball, Indeedy, Chino, some more energies, Hatrine. That Hatrine there is actually the the card that was used in the recent uh, Halloween. Uh, what were they called? I've already forgot. The Trick or Trade Booster Bundle, that's the one. If you're new to the channel and you haven't seen that Halloween video, go back and have a look at that. Again, I'll put a link in the description so you can have a look at that channel. What we did was we managed to get some of the Trick and Trade Booster packs from America, crack those open on the channel, try to build a full set of all 30 cards. It's quite a fun video to make, that one was. Uh, Switch, Egg Incubator. So as you can see, it's a ready-made deck. What you can do is sort of go straight into straight into a battle with this if you wanted to. Stick them in some sleeves, get yourself straight out there to your locals and play with some real people. With the code card that we showed earlier, you can also play this deck online, which is fantastic. Uh, really fun way to start if you're not too keen on going in and looking um, a little bit sort of worried about playing in front of people. What I would say, guys, is everyone has started at the lowest level. So get out there, get down to your locals, find out a nice little area that's quite local to you that you can play Pokemon. Have a have a go, just because the thing is, people, the people that you're playing against have probably been in your shoes, never played before, and you're going to sit there and they'll help you out. It's not sort of you're not going to be um, you're not going to be shot down if you do something wrong. They'll just point you in the right direction. It's the best way to learn. So that's it for this video guys, like I say, really short video just to show you that Mewtwo battle deck. Really good place to start if you want to buy a deck that's ready and you can go out and play straight away. If you do like this content and you like videos like this where I'm going through deck building and things like that, drop a comment in the comment section just to let me know so that I can make more of these videos. And remember to like and subscribe, um, follow me on social media and I'll see you next time.